Hi, my name is Billy Griffith, and I am the Director of Youth Ministry at St. Aloysius Catholic Church, and I'd like to give you a little bit of an introduction to our Life Teen program here at St. Aloysius. So uh, come along with me, and uh, I'm going to walk you through what we do at Life Teen and how we run things here. So you need to know where to go if you're coming into Life Teen. We're located in the lower level. We're just past this room right here. This room is called the lounge. And the lounge right here is just where we have plenty of couches. It's a cozy little space to hang out whenever you want to. And then you come through this door right here into the life teen room. A few things right off the bat that you'll see is this calendar of dates and events right here, usually broken down by the month. You'll see plenty of life nights listed and even uh, special trips that will be taken like the Eucharist and Congress. On this table, you'll also see other things that are free for you to take. We'll have a calendar of dates for the semester. We have prayer cards. We've got a sign-up sheet for any events that we'll be taking off campus. And then we have this thing. It's called the fishbowl. And if you have any questions that we weren't able to answer in a night, just come back here, write it down on a slip of paper, throw it in here, and we'll try to answer it uh, on a fishbowl night sometime during the semester. Next, you'll see this table right here. Again, it's got more prayer cards, free for you to take. It's got a cell phone basket right here, so at the beginning of the night, just come in, drop your cell phone off, pick it up before you leave. Grab a name tag and slap it on. And then if you're in the confirmation class for high school, you'll sign in right here. Just put a check mark by your name and the date you showed up. One of the first things you need to know when coming to Life Teen is what we do on a Sunday night. A life night can be broken down into five distinct parts. The first part is dinner. Every time you come to Life Teen, you're going to be fed. The second part is called the gather. The gather is when we come back together in the main meeting space and we go over opening announcements, we introduce any new teens, and then we do a fun icebreaker or skit. The third part of the evening is called the proclaim. The proclaim is when you're going to get the teaching for the night. The fourth part is called the break. At the break, you go into your small groups. Now, small groups aren't really in a classroom setting. They're more of small faith sharing groups where you go with a core member and your group and you share where you are in your faith journey. And the group is there to talk things out and to pray for one another. And the fifth and final part of the Life Night is called the Send. The Send is where we all come back together as one large group and then we pray together. And that's Life Night in a nutshell. But that's really just an explanation of what we do. You need to know who we are. And for that, I'm going to hand things over to a group of teens who have been through the Life Teen program, and we're going to hear what they have to say. I like Life Teen because of the family feel and how relatable the core team is and how you can get close to them very quickly when you first come to Life Teen. I like Life Teen because you feel like you're at home and everybody here is friendly and kind and they act like you're family. I like how the environment is more welcoming and how Life Teen is not only an organization but it's like a family you can go to. Everyone is just so caring and loving. I like the people. I've met so many great friends and um, I just hang out here you know every Monday, Wednesday and Friday. And my favorite thing about Life Teen is that it's like a family. What I like about Life Teen the most is just how much you learn. I like that you can like come every week and just learn about your faith and be surrounded by a bunch of people that share your faith. I enjoy coming to Life Teen because there are fruitful discussions that we have. My fondest memory of Life Teen so far is probably the spring retreat. Probably the best memory that I have is the walk-ins. It's a nice social night for everyone to come together and just enjoy each other's company. Probably maybe one of the earliest walk-ins I can remember. I would play DDR with people. Um, I really like small group because it gives you a place to share and to really connect on a deeper level with not only core but a bunch of your peers and it's where you make a lot of good friendships. My favorite trip would probably be Cove Crest. Last summer when we went to Camp Cove Crest. <laughs> Cove Crest. I loved Cove Crest. Mission trip was fun. Uh, and fulfilling. This past summer's mission trip to Greensboro, we got to serve a lot of people in the area. It was definitely the Carowinds trip last year during the summer. So my advice to new teens or upcoming freshmen would be 
to not hold yourself back. Like just give yourself completely to the program and make friends. Don't be afraid to be yourself. Um, just branch out, step outside your comfort zone because it helps you grow a lot. Be open-minded to God and be open-minded to anything that's said here. Try it for two weeks. Try it and fully put yourself out there and fully open up to what happens. Just attend every life night that you can. If you're coming into Life Teen, don't be afraid to ask questions. My advice would be don't be afraid to cry. <laughs> it's a chill environment like everybody here is like a family and you will be accepted and just open yourself up and get to know new people and um, Get to know the core team members too because they're going to be some of your greatest supporters um, through your faith journey. So come to life. <laughs> That's what I said. So woo! Thumbs up. A thumbs up. Thumbs up. Thank you. Thumbs up for that. All right. <laughs> All right. Very cool. Thank you, G. I appreciate it.